You are now watching the ODTV. Where you come from? And expect to make it. And I don't. I, I definitely got a lot of love for everybody. You're calling yourself a Native American, and I look at your skin. You do. Yeah, well, you, you I'm saying I've been here for, for thousands of years. That's it. It's okay that you call yourself that. The thing is, if you want to call yourself that, that's fine. But we, but we got to still know that you, I don't know what you're mixed with or how much. I don't know all that. But we still got to pay homage and be like, you know what? I'm Native American, uh, you know, but, you know, I'm also African. Craig. Yeah, I'm you know, a chief, though, Craig. I am actually, I got the red uh, Native American. In That's easy. It. He said that, them Native, that the Native Americans taught the niggas in Africa how to build pyramids. That, that, oh, that, no. that Hebrew come from, from over here. I literally read that. There. I literally read that, though, in the science magazine, though. Ooh. I mean, you can I literally read, read that. Read, you can read it. You can read that. I'm sure you can read a lot of shit, but... Absolutely. Huh? Yeah. No, nah, he's not. Nah, he's I said a science joke, though. But, yeah. I hear well, what you're saying. Yeah, oh, but, oh, yeah, but it all depends who's writing it. Sci you know, with, because science, not science itself, but those who interpret science don't, all, don't have to be accurate. So the thing is, so when we're looking at that, to me, that wouldn't really make no... I don't know. That make that doesn't make sense to me. I That's mean, they the separate way. Negroes and uh, Africans. They like in a lot of different things. How? That's honest. But can you? How can you separate people who share a genetic lineage? They you might. We might share a genetic Paco, lineage, but that don't mean we the same people. Paco, no, what, what this is? What this is? But the, but when you're talking about the same people, you mean culturally. Africans, like, Paco, it's, it's, it's a lot of African tribes. They're not the same. But all, agreed. We understand that. All Africans are not the same. And we don't know which Africans you come from. But the point is this. It's just like this. You talk, you, you, you people, it's like, I, the best way I can say it is to just say it. That's why I wanted to make sure to be what tribe you from. But, right? but, but I will only know that if I took a DNA test and I have to take one with the right people. You yourself express how hard it is to, to find out which people are the right people. Absolutely. Okay. So since we know that there are people out there doing wrong and it, and it costs, what, three four $400 to take it, if you want both lines, my whole point is this. I can't tell you what tribe I am, but I can look at my skin and tell you what continent I'm from. As can everybody who got skin similar to mine. And we have to work with them or we're, we're going anywhere. Like, that's a fact. I talk, like, this is... They are mm -hmm. true. It's not work with them. It's like... you won't It's, have, it's, we it's have like three, four billion. And shit because we're not together. So mm -hmm. No matter how much money one person got or how much money 10 people got, it's not all consolidated. So black America don't move. That's true. That's right. My point is that Absolutely not. Africa is, is, is a place right now, we already expressed how they trying to right the wrongs that they pass. Mm -hmm. Ain't nobody on earth doing that for their people. Europeans are not telling white Americans to come home. Asia is not telling Native Americans and, 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 and Mongoloid Colombians to come home. I mean, the only one thing to be stepping up is, uh, uh, what is it, Ghana? No, well, it's not, not just Ghana. Ghana. There's a few of them. There's it's a few of them. It's already eight of them in the African Union. Kenya, Ethiopia. I don't know. I don't know about Rwanda, I believe. Yeah, I think I know uh, it's eight of them. Right, at least eight of them mm -hmm. right now. They yeah, because every time I turn on the net, it's it's a, I see another one. Yeah, yeah. Talking about, I would actually move over there now because we ain't got no wind over here right now. But that's what I've been explaining to you the whole time, and you've been telling me that you was always here. You made it seem like hey, that's a fact. Nah, it's a fact to the point of. All right, let me ask you a question. Mm -hmm. Black people in America that were slaves that pretty much the country got built on their back, right? Mm, yeah, and so you yeah. That's what I'm, no, they were slaves, Paco. They were brought here from Africa. They did not enslave them in America. Are you always trying to slide the slide shit in? No, nah, that's just what I said. I ain't sliding nothing in. My point is this. Who paid for America to be built? I'm not talking about right Who or wrong. Paid? I'm not talking about right or wrong right now. I don't know. Well, well we do. That I don't know. You just, it's Europeans, right? My opinion is the Europeans, Jews, yeah. Europeans. Europeans. 
So when I know that Europeans pretty much oversaw all the constructing of America, I know that my last name mm-hmm. is European, your last name is European. Mm-hmm. I know that we speak their languages and no other languages. I know that we believe in their religion or the religions that they introduced us to in no other I mean, religion. that's all school, yeah. So my point is this. What has America done for you again? Nothing. Not, nothing lately. Now, this is how much I, I've been trying to show you that they done t- taught you to hate Africa. These motherfuckers got their hand out, and you just keep saying you don't have a problem with them. I mean, I heard the best of the Africans say we're from here now. So I heard the best of the people who said we Africans but now you say we're from here now. Ago, you just said you're from Africa. I told you a hundred thousand years ago don't make like hey, you got to call everybody everybody got to be African Chinese people Europeans right. every, the way you just, just so me, saying it, everybody got to be from there let me help you out you know why they and I agree with you I'm just saying just say call everybody African not just me everybody wouldn't be African no 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 get hair you, you what they are over there is is us we still keep their we still have their their direct lineage. Well, of course, every every human being is the Asians and and the Europeans to a certain degree, but they don't they don't keep we still a, pretty much in original form. We now I know people might say, well, we don't look like Africans. All you got to do is have an African mix, just a little bit of European blood in, and then you have us because of the race. Amongst everything else he mixed with. Yeah, yeah. I mean, I'm just saying, but like, you know I mean? we are still, we still, look, yeah, we still are at, we still look. Our I, I try to explain African. it every way. When you start with 100% African, the only thing that can yeah. happen is you can introduce small percentages of other shit to it. The reason why the people in Asia are considered Asian and not African, because I think we got different skull sizes, though, than that, like that's two. Fair, Paco, that's not, you're wrong. I'm telling you, you're wrong. There's going to be some that's the same and some that's the different. That, like skull sizes, mm-hmm. they, they differentiate in centimeters. That's what they differ, mm-hmm. but the male, the, the male human, Homo sapien, has an average skull size. The child has an average. The woman has an average. You can't talk about this stuff. That stuff is not real. You're just saying things. That's not. That's not. I'm really not. The skull side is irrelevant. It, 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 wouldn't, it, it, wouldn't even, it wouldn't even really matter, like because just look at Africans, and then you look at us, and you. And it's only a few degrees off. Exactly. Like, like and some of them look. I mean, because we're lighter, and we typically are lighter. But you know, there's some Africans that look like that. That is light as me and you, Scott. Um, yeah. You know what I mean? So it. But really, it just. If you look, most of them are darker. But if you look at a dark-skinned African, all you got to do is postulate. Well, okay, if this was, if this, uh, if this uh, guy's uh, ancestors were were uh, raped. You know what I mean, and yeah. such an amount of you know, like percentage. This is what an African would look like, I like an American, a black American. Yeah. So it's really, I mean, we make this thing so difficult and technical, but but the, I just, well, you know, we're trying to find this and find that. We're trying to escape the the pain that we deal with and the pain that we in, and we just got to face this shit head on and start fucking riding for each other. Absolutely. Don't, don't, you know what I mean? We just got to ride mm-hmm. for each other. Cause, cause, cause and, and that's not my argument because I, I I got a lot of love for Africans even like but sure, around my, around sure where I'm at. We all got love for each other. You sure mm-hmm. have yeah. a lot of love for yourself. Only thing you can yeah. claim it outside of Africa, brother, is a small percentage of your DNA, a culture, a religion, or something. I think y'all be surprised Africa. if you went to Africa and they say that y'all from here. I just think y'all be surprised. What happened though? They telling you they want they want the joint telling you to come home right now. They say come home. Right now. Come home. Right now. I'm gonna yeah, but here's the from Ghana that just got 120 Americans over there. I know Jabari be taking them over there on the tours and everything. I already know they going black people is going over there. Ghana is a little different though. No, nah, it's not a little different. They just one of the first people that was doing it. So that means when you start, it's almost a European country. But yeah, I hear you. What? I said it's almost a European country because a lot of Europeans be over there. That's black people. It's ran by black people. It, it, it's popular. That's right. Yeah. What I'm trying to teach you. It's is Africa. Africa. It's in exactly. Africa. It, but that's that's the point. There's places in, in Africa that was ran but by. Didn't people. they say uh, we came over here on slave ships? I, I mean, I admit some did. Yeah. 
Yeah, yeah, we, uh, yeah, we know everybody from Africa didn't. We know that. But most of us did. Probably most of us did. And I was trying to tell him, he know, he like he, he we we had a whole Craig. I had so much shit about the boats, and I broke down the math on the boats. If I was just able to send X amount of ships per month, how many ships did it a year? Now, if I'm sending ships for 400 years, do you know how many ships I can send? The proof is it's a lot. The it's a lot. Proof, and it's, yeah. The only proof you ever need is the fact that white people are a bigger population than you are. How the fuck you think they got here? They all came on boats. <laughs> and in the bowels of them boats, a space that was not big enough for cargo. Some boats had 20 niggas, some boats so had the white people was up top, the black people was on the bottom. Absolutely. That's what you're saying? The same way it is in this country today. On the boat, though. The same way it is in this country today. It's a lot of white people here, so all of them was on the top of the boat, right? Yup. And we was on the bottom. They ancestors, yes, because it was. And it was mongoloids over here, just mongoloids. Yup. No, it was mongoloids and negroids, but the negro it wasn't that many of either. We talking about a few million total. So if these people was coming over here for hundreds of years, they gonna overrun them. After they overran the mongoloids, they fought amongst themselves. So on the Santa Marie and all the rest of those, the Pinto and all that shit, we was underneath them boats. Historically, Paco, don't trim it down. Let's talk about nations who was doing it. Whole countries, rich countries yeah, with yeah. money that were well, bringing people. Yeah, you Slavery was a thing over there, yeah. Yeah, I mean, you just got to look at the time. I mean, it was a, that was quite a bit of time. And, yeah, it, it can, yeah, it can, uh, and you know how vicious the fucking white man is. Once they got here, you know, they started taking the red man the fuck out. I mean, he's oh, yeah. the Native American. So, of course, they're going to overpopulate him eventually. And you got hundreds of years of, 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 of just procreating. Yeah, yeah, it's going to happen. Yeah, yeah, they, 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 they can never do to the black and brown in Africa because it's too many. They can never exclude a number to take that land. That's why the people will always remain strong. Their strength is the strength that we in America say we looking for. Unity. And they strong now because they're that's, unifying. That's why I said we all will be African. Nah, this but is, you already the whole know, conversation bro. is irrelevant. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Huh? I mean, we, we, I mean, yeah, because the thing is, yeah, I, I, I mean, wow, this is, uh, ooh, this is something, but yeah, we we I we I mean we are Africans. I mean, it, it, I mean I'm not, even if we came, even if a hundred thousand years, you still it still is not going to. Ch- I mean, I guess we do we do change to a certain degree. I guess people can evolve or mutate to certain groups, but we didn't mutate and evolve differently like like Indians or Chinese. You know what I mean? Yeah. We still got that. We still got that foundation. Like, you know, it, it's just something in us. We still are African. You know what I mean? And and until we know, see, that's why the European. That's why he he got us not worried and hating Africa, but he stayed the fuck over in Africa. You know, trying to get everything he can from Africa because he knows that's where the shit is really at. It's always been. yeah. When you see the Egyptian stuff in America, that's because Egypt was in America. When you see no, the no Egyptian shit. stuff in no America, shit. and that's what I'm telling you, you ain't got that here. You ain't but got why it gotta be why they got why they gotta be from Egypt? Why can't they just be from here? They not from here, bro. How would they have Egypt stuff? What you mean? How would that they have they, stuff they, that's created exactly mm-hmm. so let me ask you this? Two people can create the exact same car on two different parts of the earth and not never come in contact with each other? I mean, people, are, like, even if that was the case, people travel, ain't that what I'm saying? That's, that's I'm nothing. You, we traveled over there and yeah, showed them how to make pyramids. Yeah. yeah, that's a Byron sand. Like, either we showed them or we were here in Mexico doing it. Yeah. And that's my point. When you say the people came from Niger Congo River, that's Africans. They left Africa and came to America. So all your civilization... The reason why your Quetzalcoatl is the same as the North Serpent God and is the same. But they didn't get hit over the head. Why they ain't making no pyramids? Say that again? They didn't get hit over the head by the Europeans. So they should be able to still make those. Who didn't? Who, you talking about? Mm-hmm. Who, you talking about? Who didn't get hit over the head by the Europeans? 
the Africans didn't get hit in the head. What? So they should have had that same, they should have that same culture. What you Africans are you talking about? Europeans never defeated Africa. Like, they might have had a couple of victories in the Congo or the South. Uh, no, 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 hold on, stop, stop, real quick. You know, okay. every, every damn country is a European name in Africa. Uh, yes, sir. Europeans carved Africa up. Yeah, it's called the Berlin Conference. You should look that up. They are uh, all, it was, or they call it the Scramble for Africa. They dominated in Because uh, there's no such thing as borders. You're right. Yeah, yeah, because they created, the Europeans created that. Yeah. And, um, and that's what divided Africa more. That's why the Congo, the Congolese believe they're different than the Nigerians. Nigerians think they're different than, a, uh, than say, the Su Sudanese. That's how it works. But they're all Africans. You know what I mean? They're all black. Yeah, they do, they, yeah, they do that. They say that, yeah. Yeah, yeah exactly. They they, 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 yeah, they all have been. they just as bad as we are. And I try to, I'm try, that's what I'm trying to tell you. So when I tell you your name, come from them. That let me know you was on the boat too, nigga. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I mean, it's real, man. They did. They, they, colonial, they colonized Africa, man. Big town. Yeah, yeah you know, South Africa. So I'm wrong about that. South uh, Africa. They just South Africa, brother. No, 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 no. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's it's more than that. Yeah, it's uh, they, the only land they never conquered. It was two parts. People only think it was one, but it was two parts. Excuse me. I I gotta find. It was a small country in the west, and it was also Ethiopia. They never conquered Ethiopia. No. Yeah. You know what I mean? But it's mm -hmm. you might as well say they did because. If they, if the reality is that when they can't take over a country, you know what they do? They they uh they they uh they they put sanctions on these countries mm -hmm. like they did with Haiti, like they did with Haiti in the 1804 video. They they, and they put in their own uh kind of government, yeah. Yeah, so they make sure that so that they they don't get trades and goods from other countries, and they start um and, and they, you know the country goes. To that's what they they do. So they, it, that's why you see a lot of poor people and starving people in Ethiopia. That's my 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 view of uh, my perception on you know the impact on it. But but they never actually went in and conquered it. But but there's only a few places in Africa that they never actually came in and conquered. Exactly. Yeah, yeah they, that's they, true. They dominated Africa. That's why when you say. When they say, but if you go over to Africa and they say, oh, you don't belong here, you from America, you know, you, Pac, you might be right. It doesn't make them, it doesn't make the the, the statement true, but it, it, it speaks to the, the power and, and it speaks to the, uh, the level of conditioning that the Africans have the same way we have of them. Exactly. Yeah, we got a lot of family ties in Africa. That's facts. Yeah. Yeah. So, so yeah. So. It doesn't matter. It's irrelevant what, what we say here and what they say over there. If you start, if we study and we link this shit, we go right back there. We can't go nowhere else. Can't nobody black on earth. I don't care if you're from Asia, if you're from India, if you're from South America, if you're from an island. All the black people. But I'm just saying the way you talk, everybody got to be African, nah, though. But That's, it don't work like that because you have It ain't just a, the, the dark-skinned people. It's not. That's your, I didn't say it was just the dark-skinned people. That's not how it works. The reason why Asians are considered Asians, because the people, black people who left Africa, mix with other hominids that no longer exist. That's what created... I mean, the Chang people, I mean, not what they call it, uh, what they the uh, Inu and the, uh, the other one that looks, they, they, they related to us. But what I forgot what they call it. The point is, so are the other ones. But the tall all ones. All right, listen to what I'm telling you. If black people mix with Neanderthals and make white people, black people mix with other shit and made those mongoloids that you call Asians, the people you call Mexican, the people you call Colombian, those people are called mongoloid by race. Those people come from black Africans leaving Africa, going into Asia and encountering other species of humanoids, just like here in America. So I, I, earlier I said it didn't happen, Paco. When black people found all humanoids, they procreated with them. They, that's just what they did all over yes, the earth. That, yeah, that's what I said. Yeah. The place where it happened the most is Asia. It creates the race called mongoloids. All mongoloids come from negroids, <laughs> black Africans, mixed that's, with I, I know about all that, but yeah. species of humanoids that no longer live. That's the difference between them and us. 
our ancestors didn't mix with those with those other humanoids that no longer exist. That's why that's why they're mongoloid and we're still negroid. Mm-hmm. Well, we are the only ones who are pure human, huh? The African is the only one that are pure human, right? Absolutely, right. If you're talking about what what would be the first the first Homo sapien, like I, that's why I said the dark ones, Paco. The the jet black ones they come first. The color lightens; it doesn't darken. As you mix things in it that are lighter than the original color, it lightens. The only reason they uh they they're hundred percent human because they don't have Neanderthal in them. No, 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 exactly. They don't have anything else. They don't have any Mongoloid. They don't have any Denisovan. They don't have any 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 anything. The jet black ones, yeah. the the they, the ones that are still mm-hmm. tall as hell, the Nalotic Nalotic people, <laughs> as they call them. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Those people are the original. Like they're still untouched. They don't mix with nobody. They only mix with themselves. And you truly don't know that I come across Africans and they treat me well. I treat them well. I haven't seen them open their house up to me. I haven't seen it all. That's not, that's not science. Now you talk that don't mean that we not, that don't mean they can't be my mother. It just means that we got different <laughs> history. That's it. Yeah, yeah. That's all it is. It's social. That's yeah. what all it is. It ain't no more than that. It, 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 that's what I said. So don't ever say you're a culture. Don't differentiate yourself. A Liberian African and give you the shirt off his back, brother. But Not like, what's the other one? Africa Lebanon. One there's of them. A lot of people in Africa that do that. You know what's a billion black people there? I don't, hmm? think, I don't think everybody moved the same way at all any way you look at it. The point of the matter is in America, they got waves going on. ADOS. Uh, Hebrews. Israel. That's because we're confused. We don't know who we are. No, That's we why. We know who we are. Some of us do. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I, I, mm-hmm. I'm one of them. You're not. Cause this, because, you know, so what's the point of this phone call? What was the point of, what was the Bruh, point of the I'm, media? I'm saying, I, you know I got a lot of uh, Native American his, history as well as indigenous you black history. What I'm history. to you is this. Let me, let me help you out. Let me help, I, try, I said this to you before, and like I said, it's, it's gloss right over your head. And really, that just makes us Americans, and no, that, that, period. That, that, nationality, you're American. That's, the, that's your geopolitical part. People can steal our identity, but that don't mean nothing. You know what I'm saying? Because, because, you don't under, because you're still looking at the white man's culture. That's the white man's mindset. I'm not. That's the white man's mindset. He think he different because he an American. He say he not European. He American. You never heard nobody say I'm a uh, I'm a, a Irish American. White people say they're Americans. It's they used to. People, yeah. No, they always do. They still do. They was doing it before we was. So stop yeah, that's that. True. That's the, more of their philosophy. Well, Jesse Jackson have. named us African Americans. Like he coined that but, phrase. But, 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 no, I don't believe that that comes from Jesse Jackson. I mean, we called ourselves Negroes, uh, Indians, I, I guess. What uh, else, uh, uh, Brian? Huh? He, he did coin something. He made it popular, but ain't it, a, ain't it a, uh, like a, um, a political? I'm sure it was brought up maybe before there from somebody else, but he co- he well, definitely he coined made, it. Made, I think somebody did give him, yeah, he gave, somebody did, I heard something about that. Yeah, I can't be 100%. Yeah, he made it popular. I understand what you're saying. My, my point is, I'm not saying call yourself African American. That's not the point. I'm fine with you calling yourself whatever you want to call yourself. But when you're talking about what you out here spewing to other black people or what you yourself think in your heart of hearts, anytime you say, I'm this, I'm not African, Anytime you put that in front of it, like if you was to say I'm an American African, that's wrong because you're from Africa first. If you're a Native American, you was in Africa before you was a Native American. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Your history and your legacy. All so the- everybody can take our identity as Americans. Everybody just from that title alone. Everybody, can't take everybody can take our stuff, huh? Obama's an African American. You know this, dog. You know this. What I'm saying is this. Everybody can <laughs> Paco. Already, my man Bam is an African American. How he, how are we gonna separate? I mean, I'm I'm not saying separate the two. I'm I mean, saying I guess, I guess only he get different to... things than I get, and I'm saying that's still governmental. But but they got immigrated from Africa. It, it, how are we gonna separate those people from us? You don't have to. Once they once they apply for American citizenship, you don't have to. So, but in today's world, I think it's a good thing. If if, if 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 it wasn't if it wasn't uh, uh if we went under the system that we under the day then that'd be fine that wouldn't matter would it exactly 
if these people never did none of what they did, we would have never left Africa, probably. Because we can't fight over that kind of stuff. Because what about mixed people? They not black. They not well, mixed people, African. Well, like again, it would depend on what your ancestors, what you mix with. So the way it was explained to me is this: when the Negroid mix, when the Negroid mix with a Negroid and make a Negroid, and the Negroid mix with a Mongoloid, it can make it makes a Negroid. When a Negroid mix with a Caucasoid, it makes a Negroid.